It's all about getting the right people in the right seats on the bus, as Jim Collins said. We want to get people in alignment on projects that couldn't get done in a month, could get done in three days because you got the right person aligned with that passion. And here's the first area, flow. Flow has to do with losing track of time. Mikhail Chesmahalli, the sociologist, talked about how he would call experts from every field and then he'd check in with them on what time it was. They could never tell. Whether they're a physician or an artist or a scientist or a technologist, you lose track of time. Flow. Secondly, it's something that you could do with the greatest of resilience. You could do it despite fatigue, despite failure. You get up the quickest when you're in a state of passion. Third, I'm talking about accountability. This is the first thing you want to sign up for is something that you're passionate about. Notice this on the people on your team. Fourth, now I'm not suggesting that anyone ever do anything secretly for free, but the truth of the matter is when somebody's passionate about it, they're not watching the clock as much. This is worth noticing in your best talent. They want to get this done beautifully. They all have a standard that's even higher because they're passionate. This fifth area is really critically important. I noticed it last night at the parties. I think you might experience it tonight. It's really important. You bore people at cocktail parties when you're in a state of passion. <laughs> they will ask you a question and you will not shut up. You're looking at your watch. How do I go on to the next person? Oh, it's kind of loud. I can't hear you. You become politically incorrect, right, when you're passionate. You're not so sensitive about what other people think. This is interesting to watch. Now, it's annoying to see in other people sometimes, but notice it in your customer. Notice it in the teammates that you have. What are they getting lost around? Have them do more of that. The sixth area is collaboration. If you want people to collaborate, they got to want to be together on the bus. You know, people know when you don't want to be with them. I'm sorry, you could fake it for a while, but it's just the way it is. It, it's visceral. They can feel it. So collaboration is irresistible. I mean, there's very few times in a person's life, or in any time in your life, that you actually might be able to be a part of something in your job where you actually have a profound impact on the lives of others. How often does that really happen? You're the most admired people in this business. You're the top 1%. Who better than you to lead us into this new world that's already transforming lives? I know it, I feel it. And I really admire where you can take us tomorrow.